Strike is one. Teamwork is dream work. What's the hurt? Oh, so sorry.
Ad Astra Abbot. Thank you for completing. T Ad Astra. No one's joined me on an adventure in ages!
Frozen in time. Off we go. I'm going in. Huh? Oh, yeah. Dodge this.
bodied. For a little obey cryo incarnate Flag fly and Strike is one and leap. Ha! 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 
Come a little closer. to enjoy this. Submit! <laughs> Give up! Touch of 
Frost! Spare myself the hair and makeup routine today, and happily idle my time away. I saw her, but purposely avoided her. As both the Lion Fang Knight and acting Grand Master, she naturally would have some reservations towards me. If I'm not careful, one day I may find myself becoming the object of one of her investigations. But back to the matter at hand. I defeated some of the Abyss forces, but wasn't able to gather any information. Did you have more success? I see. Well then, we can more or less figure out where the first field tiller ended up. Huh? Really? Just from the Lupus Boreas story? That information combined with a more comprehensive analysis. For example, the old story you told me you heard in the cathedral. Exactly. The strange story told to you by that young sister, long mistaken to be a curse rained down by a deceased tyrant. Ah, Paimon gets it! So the tyrant's final fury was really just missiles fired from the field tiller after, after it was damaged, and then, whenever anyone got close, back then, the people of Monster- It looks like we need to make a trip to Storm Terror's lair and comb the entire area. Hmm, what do you mean? Huh? You mean- <gasps> Oh, Paimon remembers too! We saw that abandoned ruin guard sitting atop the tower when we went there before. Can't forget something like that. could use on our journey? <sighs> this is it, right? <sighs> okay then, 
you... Ooh, so what did you see? This requires using elemental sight on a field. Let me give it a try. And done. Wow! It's the very thing all of the ruin guards to prototype? As the Abyssal, and if the limbs and this newly born god will have the power to topple the divine thrones of Celeste, yes. Then, which? No. Huh? You may doubt me if you. No matter where we may hide. Oh! But our work isn't done yet. To avoid any further repercussions, we must also take care of that defiled statue. We can't have the. <sighs> Do the seven really ex- Let's go back to those ruins and I'll make sure it doesn't- Fortunate. <laughs> Dodge this.
gonna hurt in the morning. Ugh. Oh, so sorry. Keep back! Still a long road ahead. Starfall. Drop. Keep this close.
I'm looking forward to this. Wish me luck! <laughs> so after all that running around, we end up right back here again. Look at us. We barely escaped this place last time, and now we're strolling right back in! Gee, surely we must be some of the bravest adventurers in all of Tavat! That are the stupidest. To get to that creepy statue... We just need to follow the path we used to escape last time. That should take us right to it. Yep, that'll work! Let's go! Like we're an eerie, lifeless dog. Oh. Be careful to not. You are just. A... I sense your. Oh, then we are the. It is your word. Time to silence you. Bow before the abyss. Uh, out of the way. We got to the Why do they never miss? Adventure time. Ta Let's light it up. Don't push your luck. Any more bandages? Push 
your luck. Oh. Ah, dodge this. Don't see that. Ha. Ha. You with Dane. Uh huh. Your brother knows Dane? <gasps> Ether. We meet again. Uh, what's going on here? Dane knows him too? You shouldn't team up with this man. He is my enemy. Ether. <laughs> but it must be said. Don't try to stop me. Don't try to stop the Abyss. That man Dainsliff was the Twilight Sword. One of the royal guards of the final dynasty of Conria. 500 years ago, he failed to prevent the destruction of Conria. A curse of immortality was laid upon him, 
to forever wander the wilderness while he watched the people he was supposed to protect turn into the monsters of the abyss. You're saying Dane is from Conria? The same Conria that was destroyed 500 years ago? And you said the people turned into monsters? You're trying to tell Paimon that the Abyss Order is not only related to Conria, but is actually the people of Conria themselves? Uh, and the whole thing about Dane being your enemy... Oh, Paimon's so confused. Um... Yes, of course. Home is wherever we are together. But I cannot go with you to the next world to find a new home. At least, not yet. Until the Abyss has engulfed the thrones, my war with destiny will see no end. Listen to me, Lumine. I have already traveled through this world once. Once you reach the end of your journey as I did, you will see for yourself the true nature of this world. So we'll meet again. Though we need not rush, sister. I have more than enough time to wait for you. We have always... Dodge this!
My demon expelling mantra is ready. Your brother would have sided with the Abyss. Well, keep your chin up. Hyman believes in both of you. And when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Right? He said we needed to reach the end of our journey. Hyman bets he still has lots more to tell us. And we won't find out what this journey is or where it will end unless we keep... Aw, oh, don't mention it, partner. Travel buddies are supposed to look out for one another. Although, where should we go next? Oh, you mean the god that took your brother away in the... F You're right. After all, everything that... F yeah. Well, we've ruled out two gods so far. Hmm. <gasps> Why don't we ask someone from Inazuma how to gain entrance? Oh, Paimon's thought of someone already! Let's, let's see what she has!
Adventure time. Off we go. Adventure time. Is there anything I can help you? We wanted to ask. Oh. Great! We can... But the chance of success... Huh. It was in leaving, and it's all I had to rely on after I'd escaped their clutches, but... To my surprise? My... Ah, uh, that's right. What a horrible journey! Well, because everything is just too... Can't you commit... Along with the other two, one of the obligations... Meanwhile, it doesn't feel good to speak ill of my home like this. But after spending so long, what I mean to say is... Unless you have... <sighs> you should know that the sea around Inazum... And even if you did manage to find a way, you'd still have... Seems like they really don't want... Any they only set that up, but if you really... Uh... That's not what I meant. Voyaging far and wide... But it's an armed fleet... That part is up to you. If you're able to persuade... The Alcor is... Then there's not... <laughs> One with my blade. Ride on wind and cloud alike. Hmm. Hmm. Who have we got here? Wait, I know you. You're that traveler, aren't you? The one who fought against the Fatui in Osile, right? <laughs> Ningguang told me about you. A traveler of great insight and remarkable skill has saved Liyue. She's a hard one to please, so praise from her is high praise indeed. I remember thinking at the time that it'd be good to meet you in person. Judging by the clothes on your back and <laughs> this floating thing, I guess that time has come. Paimon? Hmm. What a fascinating being. You two give off not only the essence of wind and earth, but also of... Yes. The stars. Huh? 
The fragrance of what now? That's the weirdest compliment po Pay it no heed. I mean only to say I am certain that it is by fate, not chance alone, that we should meet. And that gives our encounter meaning. You're not far off, but they go by a different name in Inazuma. This young man is Kaidahara Kazuha, a temporary addition to my crew for reasons I won't bore you with. Occasionally he opens his mouth and flowers come out instead of words. With this fine ship and the soft sea breeze, would it not be romantically irresponsible of me not to acknowledge it with a line or two of poetry? <laughs> well, I can't argue with that. Okay, then. Once the clash is underway, I'll give you a chance to perform. Only if the mood takes me, of course. Poetry for poetry's sake tends to lack meaning. Hey, you don't want to pass this opportunity up too easily. Especially seeing as our great hero here might be in attendance. Oh, wait a minute. What's the clash? Uh, also, just to clarify, by great hero, do you mean... Huh? <laughs> I thought you might be here to sign up. You're telling me you've never even heard of it? The Crux Clash is a martial arts tournament that I hold. There'll be- They're too important- So, you've got two. You can't take part if you've got- <laughs> And with Liu- But- Well, before you- Get this. Supplied by myself. Is there really such thing as a ma- When a vision bear- As for whether the- Yep. And the organizing the clash- So, if you don't have a vision, this is the per- Yeah! Where it- Inazuma? You? Well, why didn't you say so? In as in that case, if you you just want her. <laughs> what's wrong with that? The more what are we gonna do? <laughs> Great. It seems like it. time. Are. They said that they had to be renowned fighters. Who 
will we be up against? You bet I am. Have you put your names down yet? Well, I'd have a look at the entrance criteria if I were you. Then it'll allow just anyone to take part. The Clash is a comprehensive test of fighting ability. Anyone who turns up for show over skill is gonna get their butt handed to them. <laughs> Nobody wants to see that, right? Uh, yeah, we heard a rule about that. So... Wondering, are you a renowned fighter? <laughs> Me? Only a former runner up in the Tsuhu Rock Freestyle Combat Summit. <laughs> uh huh. Also, that doesn't sound like the most official tournament out there. <laughs> what? You. Nonsense! Have you been living under a rock? It's been going on for years. There were plenty of competitors when I took part. Not to mention, I've helped the Millilith catch treasure hoarders before. There were two of them trying to escape. I soon sorted them out. They tried to sneak past me under the cover of darkness. <laughs> they didn't know what hit them. I planted a left hook on the skinnier one's face and sent him flying. Then, I stood my ground, of course. A roundhouse kick sent the blade hurtling into a beam above us. <laughs> I told you. Unarmed, outnumbered two to one, but I still got the upper hand. I'm not saying I came up- Uh-huh. But for us, even for our five tri- Mm-hmm. I'll see you in the arena. Protect you. Hi there. Are you here for the Crux Clash, too? That's right. Nothing beats real life combat for honing your skills. That's what our master taught us. But this tournament is more than just a chance to put training into practice. It's also a chance for us to obtain the Masterless Vision. Exactly! With a vision, we'd quickly become our master's top students. This master of yours must be pretty incredible, huh? Are they someone famous? Famous? He's the founder of the Ling Shan clan, and his skills are unparalleled. Liang and I are both proud to say You probably wouldn't have heard of it. It was founded quite recently. The clan is n He's got to be a- To the Ling Shan- Force this- It's a type of bre- For example, our One time, he sent a challenger flying into the air without lifting a finger. It sure is. But it's extreme- <sighs> We're clearly not that na- There's a tuition? Of course. This is- <sighs> But recently though, we- So, if we can get our hands on a vision too, maybe we can finally make our mass- Well, we have- to Exactly. Folks will come from far and wide. Heck. See you in the arena. Hey, youngster. If so, seems I found myself another. N so you're also here for the tournament? You better believe it. For me, obtaining a vision is the final. No, no, no. I know how that. I've passed every in most people's a vision. You have so much self-confidence. That's not important. I've also brought a of course. I also put in a few good days pre- Ha! <laughs> now then, if you don't mind, I need to finish my pre-competition routine. It's not too long now before- So, to recap, we're up against an inflated ego, some gullible guys paying way too much for their kung fu classes, and another guy who's just... really average. Chinksa Village Arm Wrestling Champion, huh? Next, please. What's your name? Wait, uh, oh, did I hear that right? Is it really them? Uh, huh? Aren't they a vision bearer, though? 
Why are they trying to enter the Clash? Uh, I, I have to ask. Aren't you the traveler that helped Liyue fight off that ancient god? It's really her! The one that spoke with Lady Kuching at the Rite of Parting! <gasps> oh, oh, I wonder if I can get her autograph later. I trust you are aware that, uh, only those without visions can enter the tournament? Really? But, but from what I've heard, the things you're capable of in combat are nothing short of extraordinary. You walk into the most dangerous situations imaginable, face off against all sorts of monsters, uh, even the Fatui, and always come out on top. Yep, she still doesn't have a vision though. See for yourself! Uh, my apologies. I didn't mean to be rude. I'm sure a great hero like yourself would have no reason to lie. Now, could I ask you to provide a few claims to fame? Uh, it's just a formality. So far, I've got defeated the ancient god Osile, so that's one. Do you have any others? Yeah, and also a dragon too! Put down... Whoa! Might as well declare her the champion already. I wonder if it's too late to withdraw. Okay, um, that's plenty. Right, you're a great hero. Oh, we're not here for that. There's another prize, too? Oh, first I've heard of it. Beto must have upped the stakes this time to attract... But why would anyone... I see. So, well, no, anyway, the qual... Hey, so even though you don't... So, Paimon... In any case, looking at the competition... All right, it... You seem like you're raring to go. Are you ready to compete? Good. Then please follow. Come on, let's go sign up! Our next competitor is seen by many as the favorite to win this tournament. Her first bout begins now! Y you You're the hero they're talking about? Ugh. How am I supposed to win now? What a strange guy. Why was he so confident to begin with? Well, now that we won, let's go and see Beto. She'll probably have something to say to us. <laughs> I knew I wouldn't regret it. So, what do you think, Kazuha? She totally... Impressive. Well, I fought so come on. We all know you've got a wide vocabulary in there. All right. You fought well. Ugh, all right then. You know, a lot of com and since you signed up <laughs> for one thing, so I'm p huh? This is how Captain besides. <laughs> all right. I'm We're finally here, folks. The real show is about to be <laughs> Your opponent has... You may well be... Very well. All right, that's enough ch Your opponent in the semifinals is... I do not doubt your... Relax! My girl's at... Okay. At last, the moment we've all been waiting for. The semifinals have begun! Who's it gonna be this time? The hero or the dark horse? I don't care about the prize. You're a strong opponent. That's what I'm. I'm sweating all over. It's a good feeling. Congratulations. I was beaten by the best. I need to- Right! If you had a- I want the division. But mine? I lost interest. I fought and- Huh? No, I did- Only in def- wow. If you have the chance in the future, please- uh, by the way... Whether they'll be as t So don't get... There he goes. Maybe we should ask around. See what we can find... 
find out about our opponent in the- Ah, it's you! I myself- Ah. Uh. Why, yes. I faltered for- Given my stature- Still, I'm sure- Hey there! He tried to use for- His opponent was pr- Why don't you dodge, they ask? Because to not- Don't even get me started. I spent all my energy. I don't dare tell my master about- Sorry, I shouldn't be comp- Oh! Thanks, I'll- <sighs> We still haven't got any useful information yet! Maybe we can go tell- You gave an outstanding- I could sense that you're not familiar with Bob, but you were quick to adapt. And managed to claim victory. In fact, I. <laughs> I guess not using your elemental power. We wanted to. Not exactly. As for the guy, what's the matter? Worried that you've. If that is the case, I haven't prop. Uh, yeah! It is true that I. I do not mean to. Given your talent. Hang on! Gathering intel besides our fate. You bet, huh? <laughs> <laughs> However, there. Come with me. Some post match. Now that we're alone, let me cut to the heart of the matter. You are skilled in manipulating the elements. And not just a single element, but multiple. Paimon knew that you were hinting at something from the moment we met! That's right. If the other c if I'm not mistaken, you share these consideration. <laughs> Since a young, it is things of this as crazy as all my humble ab to think a human could wield the elements without a vision, and not to mention your. Hey, stop evaluating. Could you perchance enlighten me as to how you manage? Hmm. So then, might I be so? Ah, uh, it's not. Th it's been a long. Honestly, he. Perhaps such un. However, I. St of course, I too shall. Now then. Your skills in battle are truly beyond reproach. Your opponent is skilled at controlling his breathing and maintaining balance, which enables him to execute moves. He relies entirely on the element of surprise. In other words, as long as you remain mindful of- Please, save your thanks. If any- The world is a tr- You seem I desire to know- And what influence is- My apology. For allowing me the honor of witnessing your- So that's what you're curious about? 
As you well know, visions are in the outset. Not to mention... She sounds... As far as I know, the U.S. contracts are meant to benefit all who reside with... It goes without saying that the people locked within Inazuma do not... Fa sounds a lot like... Oh? Have you encountered the Electro Archon before? With time, we will change. If you wish to find her, she will forever be there. There will come a day when I too shall wish to understand. Ah, the time for your match is approaching. Oh, right. We got so distracted talking. If you have no other matters to attend to, then we can reach very well. Let's go. Never mind. We can. Everyone, listen! We've reached the. We've seen many. Now, I'd like. She strikes. Wow! <sighs> I'm. I'm sure everyone. But today's final round. As for our other combatant. Uh, he still. Oh, come on, what could be taking. Apologies! Everyone, just sit tight. We've got no other choice. Wait a moment. Captain Beto, traveler. Let me see. That's gone, all right. Huh? We don't know when it w <laughs> No need to worry. Hmm. The vision was the... <sighs> well, if I'll stay here and try to offer some explanation to all the spectators that came to see the match. If you would, please come with me. Um, but... Come with me. I can see... The winds have come at an opportune moment. Let's seize this chance. Ride the winds upward. From there, we can continue our search for clues. It was stolen. Well, then why didn't you stop him? You'll see shortly. are guiding us forward. The culprit is on the opposite shore now. You can hear that too? What does it sound like? Hmm. Hubris. This way. Follow me. There may be an ambush waiting for us up ahead, but I trust that you are well prepared for such a scenario. Treasure hoarders, just as I expected. In which case, please stand back. Uh, not careless. Uh. 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 
You caught up with me? How is that possible? I had even prepared a bow to ensure a quick getaway, and still you caught up to me! No boat could ever match the speed of the wind. The wind? What are you talking about? Oh, I get it. Your vision. Drat! If I only had a vision! Or, if I could activate this one, then you'd never be able to catch me! This has nothing to do with visions. You may be skilled at vanishing from a crowd, but it seems you know precious little about how to conceal yourself from nature's gaze. Additionally, your chosen escape route was flawed for reasons that are too numerous to go into, and on top of that, I could hear your boasting and proud laughter in the wind as I was pursuing you. In other words, you failed to meet any of the basic criteria for a grand heist. Namely, speed, stealth, and style. You... you... But most disappointing of all is the state of the vision in your hand. It appears that the vision doesn't respond to human desire indiscriminately. Fine! Fine! I admit it! I've had my eyes on this vision for quite some time now. I decided to register after hearing that this fighting contest was full of a bunch of lousy fighters. I fought my way to the finals and... Aha! So you were supposed to be our opponent! I'd intended to win the contest through skill alone all along, but then you showed up. After watching the semi-finals, I knew that I didn't stand a chance. But I wasn't about to give up on the vision so easily after coming all this way! Since there was no use in trying to face you in the match, I decided to put my skills to good use while everyone's attention was on you and Beto. I was convinced I prepared thoroughly for my escape, but somehow, you still managed to catch up to me. After all I went through to get it? I think not! I know an empty threat when I hear one! Fine. But you'd better mean it. It didn't activate once I took it anyway. It's nothing but a useless shell to me. You know, according to the laws of the sea, the penalty for stealing He's breaking the culprit's arms. Huh? You're not serious, are you? Not to mention that the item you stole was a prize. You didn't show up for the final match, and you damaged the reputation of the captain of the Crux fleet. It seems that it would be only fair to brand the word thief on your forehead with a hot iron. Whoa, whoa! We don't need to go that far, do we? <sighs> I never would have guessed you could be so cruel. If this is where talking gets me, then forget it! I'll risk a fight! Huh. 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 
Leave it all to me. Just you watch. But they still need me. No, no, do what you want, but please, don't brand my forehead, please! <sighs> he has persevered to the bitter end, and now death looms near. Put down the vision and leave. I've changed my mind. No further pu- uh Huh? What's wrong? Are you asking for more punishment? It's up to you. Such willingness is- No, no, no need for that. I take no pleasure in fright. When people are forced into a corner, that is when their greatest strength will appear. But unfortunately, nothing happened. Yes. I wanted to know whether it were possible for an extinguished vision to be reawakened. From the moment he stole the vision, I decided to use him for this experiment. I've tried many other methods, though few tales tell of a masterless vision reawakening. After seeing you command multiple elements, I figured that nothing is... Come, why don't you give it a try? <sighs> I see. No matter. This was expected. Yeah, what's the story behind this vision? The story begins... He was once a good friend of mine. One day he asked me about a sword art of which he had heard, the Musono Hitotachi. I told him it can only be witnessed when divine punishment is administered. It is the pinnacle of the Riven Shogun's skill, a symbol of ultimate power. But he replied, there must be one who can withstand it. There will always be those who dare to brave the lightning's glow. Then the vision hunt decree arrived. People's aspirations were stripped away as the Raiden Shogun began to construct her ideal of eternity. While I was fleeing from place to place, I heard that my friend had challenged the Vision Hunters to a duel before the throne. A solemn yet brutal challenge. The defeated faced divine punishment, while the victors gain a second chance. Perhaps he thought he, of all people, should make a stand. Coming face to face with the Musono Hitotachi was all that he truly desired, after all. When I arrived at Tenchukaku, the duel was over. I heard his sentence of divine punishment, his severed blade hitting the ground. Perhaps that was the glory he had yearned to witness. In his last moments, what expression was on his face? Before I knew it, I had stepped forward and snatched the dying vision and was running from the scene. All I knew was that I mustn't let his hope, which burned so brightly, become buried among the ice-cold statue of a god. Perhaps one day, I may come to find that all I have done is meaningless. But as a wandering samurai, I find meaning in traveling and the sprawling beauty- <laughs> All right, then. It's time we returned. Allow me to get... Huh? Did Beta... If you're looking for the captain, she was summoned... It seems that the Crux Clash got out of hand this time and has a... Tr captain Beto was muttering something about Ningguang being a stick in them. <laughs> It's not a But still, Captain Beto was disappointed she didn't get to witness the crowning of the new champion. She had been looking forward to it for quite some time. The one who stole the vision was originally to be this hero's opponent in the final round. He knew he stood no chance of winning the match, thus the wicked idea of stealing the prize took hold in his mind. In which case, the Crux Clash comes to a clear-cut conclusion. 
so that's what happened? If that's the case, then the rules stipulate that he is disqualified. And our hero here is the champion. Paimon thought we'd win and all, but not like this. It doesn't matter. As the saying goes, honor given is honor deserved. Now, let me go prepare the champion's medal to award you. Yes, I believe so. Though Captain Beto is no longer present here, I'll be sure she receives word of it. She is a woman of her word. But the voyage to Inazuma is a treacherous one. You will be plagued by a perpetual tempest the entire trip. In fact, the relentless rain and- Hold on a second. You're saying she can change- Let us not forget that this is one of the- Suffice it to say that if- In the meantime- I'm a believe- Thank you. One final word- Astra Abyssosk. What can I do for you, traveler? Ah, yes. I've heard that you've already made it. Now that I think about it. There you are. You're the traveler that Beidou will be taking to Inazuma, right? The fleet has nearly completed reprovisioning. Once the crews have taken a headcount, we can get underway. Captain Beidou sent me to come get you. We'll wait. Seems Beidou is the captain of her word. Of course. There are many things that the captain insists upon. I'm- So you'll be heading off then? Whether the journey before you leads to the heights of the heavens, or the depths of the abyss, each step you take is another achievement. Until we meet again, Ad Astra Abyssosk. Oh. <laughs> well, if that's how you feel, why not come and find me when you arrive? I'll be awaiting you on Narukami Island. So there's another Catherine in Inazuma? <laughs> well, I guess it's... Okay, thank you. Just following... You finally made it. All these years come rain or storm, the Crux fleet has never suffered a delay. If it were anyone else, I might have set sail all... <laughs> we set sail for the left. Anchors away!
Oh, hi there. So, you finally made it. You sure kept me waiting, Captain. And it appears we have a couple of stowaways. Or perhaps I should say, honored guests. Shush! You can blame your almighty Shogun. The tempests around Inazuma have been growing all the more fierce lately. Though the fleet was fully up to the challenge, the inclement weather still caused some delay. Now then, let me introduce everyone. This is Toma, a trade partner that I've gotten to know recently. <laughs> you don't know how long I've been waiting to see you. Toma, these two are... Oh, no need for introductions. Their reputation precedes them. It seems even the stormy seas can't keep rumors of these... <laughs> oh, it's sure nice to hear you say that. <laughs> With any luck, it'll give you a head start here. Toma's resided on Rito for quite some time now. It wouldn't be going too far to say he's the fixer around these parts. If you run into any problems here, just talk to Toma. But if he tries to pull any moves on you, I'll be sure to deal with him personally the next time I'm around. <laughs> no need to worry. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. Good. Then if it's all... all right. Until next time, Traveler. Remember to give it your all, no matter what... Now then, first things first. We need to- Um, Paimon thought we were- <laughs> Don't- uh, So we have to play by the rules, even if we're kind of- This world is full of uns-
Hello? Please state your name, identity, and the purpose of your visit. Oh, except you, Toma. You must be... new here. <laughs> Excuse me? Please provide the information requested, and also declare any goods you are carrying with you. Oh, well, I'm sorry. We cannot approve entry for purely personal reasons. So, unless you have a valid reason for visiting in a co Um... Uh... We... Uh... My apologies, but I'll have to ask you to... Here are the entry papers, for your kind perusal. What? Ugh, take your time! No rush or anything! <laughs> I just wanted to see what you'd say. I see. Okay. Your papers are all in order. Welcome to Rito. <sighs> so, where do we go next? The Outlander Affair... Uh, they only check entry permits here. If you want to remain on Rito, there's a process you have to go through with them. Sheesh! So it is super strict, just like everyone says. Well, as the word suggests, not even on Rito, where they've established an outsider settlement. <laughs> Now, let's head over. Most of the current rules were put in place by the administration of Rito, the Kanjo Commission. The Kanjo Commission? Yes, one branch of the Tri Commission of Inazuma, responsible for growing and managing the nation's wealth. Um, you really haven't heard of it before? Customer. 
you've completed the entry procedures, yes? And now you want to apply for residency, both of you? Yes, please. Okay, the processing fee will be two million mora. Two million? For a processing fee? Are you serious? That's right. One million per applicant, which makes two million total. Don't worry. You can trust my math. Paimon wasn't so much questioning your math as... <laughs> Ma'am, these two here are good friends of mine. I think you'll find I'm one face you recognize. Ah, Mr. Toma, it's you. By way of courtesy, allow me to reduce it to... 400,000 more. <laughs> Thank you, but as this is just... That's not how you hit. All right, then. <laughs> The way some here are- So, when the day comes that some poor merchant- Then they'll milk- <laughs> Exactly. It's at times like the- Yes, but when- The most that overseas merchants can do- That's how the international trade is- So it's a trade- Yep. And, essentially, it's an association devoted to- <sighs> I see. After all, the Raiden Shogun is the mo- Huh. I was going to say nothing is- Uh-huh. Okay, I'll give it to you. Really? <laughs> Connections come- <laughs> in fact, there's no real cop. I like to do things in a way that keeps... Sounds very reasonable to Paimon. <laughs> what Here's the situation. Recently, things seem... The head of this so... Hello there. You must be seeking refuge with the International Trade Association. Ah, oh, good. That's a... We heard these... Yes. Left... The Sokoku Decree certainly... But it's not the root... No. Those Mora... Oh, of the three commissions... That's right. They just issued... Crystal... Oh, some... Eventually. So, in order... But then we found... Uh... Exactly. It's a vicious cycle. The consequence of which is that our taxes will soon exceed our profit. <sighs> we, but this is a nation where the cr <sighs> Fontaine, my dear. Sounds awful. What do you think we should do? What crease is that? <sighs> right. Okay. <sighs> that vent. I've actually done bit. Hmm. Well, definitely. Hey, that's a pretty good idea. Since. <sighs>
I don't think I recognize you. Are you new arrivals? So, what do you need with me? The sheer nerve. You don't go around asking questions like that. If I gave you my sources, I might as well hand you the whole darn business. Trade secret. Got it? You know what trade... This guy's got a bad attitude. Ha! <laughs> Are you even buying? <laughs> They're wasting their time. Hey, what's... He Get out of here. Go on. What are we gonna do? There's no talking to this guy. Good idea. No? Well, by all means. Getting you to go fixing things when you've only just... Oh, that... He used to be a... I can only assume he must... Huh. Yes. Couldn't you tell when you... Sp That's right. When Inizuma... Huh. The international... Tr so he left... <laughs> I'm sure it's more nuanced. Really? Well then, it sounds... What are you doing back here? Just cause I got plenty of time on my hand. Huh? Where is this coming from? Monster? Goodness, I can sense it now. So familiar, but I can't remember the last time I was there. <sighs> the scent of Mondstadt. Oh, how it takes me back. Oh, my hometown. The home of freedom. <sighs> oh, oh. <clears throat> so, trying to play my heartstrings like a liar, are you? I know- Huh? What is this? What are you up to now? Close your eyes already! You mean... the sound of the ocean? <gasps> Leah Harbor! I can see it so clearly. Uh, oh, and the sound of the waves! The calls of the merchants! Xiao Lanterns! <laughs> I'm right there at the lantern right. Oh. This guy has a really active imagination. <sighs> Wait, stop. That's enough. Don't make me relive it anymore. My- You mean, 
The folks from the international... Often, I'll sneak down to the shore. I've run into folks from the associate... <sighs> Don't you... Um, well... <sighs> They're so... So, I caved. Those people... All right. You ready to talk now? But I betrayed them. Uh, come... So come on! It's a scheme by... They start by... Once the merchant... It's just... I'm their puppet. Yes. Evidence. Now that I think... As it happened... Really? Hey, Jero, it's him! After him! Too close! That's too... Come out! I can see you! Who are you? Why are you following me? Ah, Ryoko, how's business? All the better thanks to your generous patronage. Good. Thankfully, I earn plenty these days. Oh, but of course. Tax collection is difficult work. Now, who else is behind on payments? Let me think. Yes, the trade association click still needs to be brought into line. Hmm. What was that sound? Too close! That's too close! You'll notice this for sure! Too close! That's too close! You'll notice this for sure! What could he be doing at a place like this? It looked like he... <sighs> Whoa! It's... a ledger! Boring! Hi, Mandari! 
made him the big pile of Mora here. <laughs> yeah. Let me take a look here. Ah, yes. This is what we're looking for. A clear and complete record of every single transaction, each one proof of his guilt. Great. Well, n uh, um, I'll, I'll say goodbye to you here then. Huh? You aren't gonna come with us? I... Huh. Poor word. But we really don't have anything left. If this keeps up, our sales will come in at a loss. There'll be nothing left for us to do but starve. You know the decree. The rules are the rules. No discounts, no exceptions, and no excuses. Hmm? And who are you? Another new member of the association? It just so happens that we found your little ledger, so now we're here to tell everyone all about how you embezzled Crystal Marrow to sell it right back to the taxpayers! Huh? Is this true? You've been swindling us! Well, uh, y y you see, the, the ta taxes, uh... Let me take a look at the ledger. Well, would you look at that? Every payment the Association has made is right here in your personal ledger. So, Mr. Keijiro, it seems you have some explaining to do. How shall we settle this, hmm? <laughs> so you think you can use this against me, do you? I it's quite obvious that I'm merely trying to earn a modest living for myself, like anyone else! Word has it that Samurai and the Commission place great importance on reputation and prestige. Though I'm sure Commission members won't blame you once word gets out. Huh? Is that a threat? Are you threatening me? No, not at all. I'm simply stating that it would be quite a pity if an illustrious gentleman such as yourself were to have their reputation tarnished. Uh, well, even if what you say is true, what do you suggest we do about it? I believe you still have a quantity of crystal marrow in your possession, correct? Perhaps that crystal marrow could be used as compensation for the recent tax hike, and us merchants could finally have some more breathing room. Is that it? Oh, do you have any idea the hoops I had to jump through to get the crystal marrow and keep it hidden? Oh, uh, fine. In that case, I'll send it over to you today. And not even an answer- So that's it? My shop's been closed for weeks now. I've even had to ask my friends to help bail me out. What about my losses? Come on, Harrison. We've already struck a good deal here. I'm sick of being pushed around like this. I won't let him off so easily. Harrison. Hey, what's all this racket? Does someone dare question the decree? Ah, Chief. You've arrived. What was all the commotion I heard just now? Oh, we were just discussing a minor tax issue. I do my utmost to lend them a helping hand, but they're never grateful. A helping hand? The only thing you're doing is stuffing your greedy pockets with our hard-earned wealth. I assure you that Hirage Shinsuke will hear of this. Oh, and you dare to utter the Commissioner's name? 
You outlanders have no respect for the rules. Seize the merchants! We will resolve this dispute back at headquarters. Uh-oh. This is going in a bad direction. Gentlemen, gentlemen, come now. Is there any need for this? If there's a dispute to resolve, let's get a drink and talk it over. Who are you supposed to be? And why in my right mind would I join you for a drink? Here's my card. Huh. You're from the Yashiro Commission. Shh. Huh. Well, this is Kanjo Commission territory. However powerful the Yashiro Commission may be, you have no business meddling in Rito's affairs. <laughs> of course not, of course not. Still, perhaps you could show the young lady. of our clan some courtesy. You wouldn't want your name showing up in a petition to the Shogun, would you? That fan. The Shirasagi Himegimi. I don't need any trouble with her. <sighs> okay, let's forget all this. It'll give us one less thing to worry about. But, Chief! Enough! We're leaving! Let's get dinner one day soon, gentlemen. My treat, I insist. Uh, no response, huh? I suppose that bridge is well and truly burned, then. Thank you so much, Toma. But I'm sorry your relationship with the Kanjo Commission had to suffer for our sake. <laughs> hey, hey, I was joking. It's a small price to pay, and you're more than welcome. If there's anyone you should be thanking, it's the Traveler. She's the one who found a way to turn things around. If nothing else, I'm sure the tax collection Ashigaru will tread a little more carefully in the future. Toma? What was all that? Shh, shh. Not here. Too many people listening. <laughs> Let's move somewhere else. Enjoy the blessing of Lesser Lord Kusanali. An ancient blessing, now 10% off. Corruption seems rife in the Kanjo Commission. They truly are rotten to the core. <sighs> Alright. Time for me to answer your questions. What would you like to know? <laughs> Straight to the point. Let me reintroduce myself. I belong to the Kamisato clan of the Yashiro Commission on Narukami Island. I'm an attendant of the Shirasagi Himegimi. You've been keeping your true identity a secret from us this whole time? So, the Yashiro Commission. Guessing that's another branch of the Tri Commission? Correct. The Kamisato clan is the head of the Yashiro Commission, who manage ceremonial and cultural affairs. I'd go into more detail on what exactly that covered. I'm just someone who was for- Seems like she must be super famous in Inazuma, given the reaction of those guys- <laughs> Her fame even s I suppose those who treat others with You're asking the right questions, and- Firstly, you should know that being a fixer is not something you can fake. Still pretty good good! <laughs> Well, Inazuma may have closed off to the outside world, but that hasn't stopped a l So, when Miss Kamisato heard of your intention to come to Inazuma, she began- That is, that you have what it takes to- Change the ta- In the test I gave you earlier, although there were a few hiccups at the end, navigating powerful- With your help, even the Vision Hunt Decree- Ah, uh, hmm. That's an unexpected development. Yes, of- Huh. Don't- <laughs> Well, oh, uh, one... Good luck with everything. Thomas, not such a bad guy, huh? 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 
What's up? Oh, right! Paimon forgot all about that! Wait, so... Did Toma forget that too? Oh, darn! As soon as we... Ah. Stop there. Present your travel permits. Sorry, but we really gotta get to Narakami Island. It's kinda urgent. If you don't have a travel permit, this is as far as you'll get. Those are the- Ah, <sighs> as expected. Traveler, you gotta think of something. How do we get out of Rito? Are you saying we should go and meet with the Kanjo Commission? Guess it can't hurt to try. Who knows? Maybe he's our big... This is the Kanjo Commissioner's office. No trespassers. We're here to see... Uh... The Kanjo Commissioner seldom entertains outlanders. Leave now or we'll be forced to... Ah, wait, wait, wait. Uh, oh, Commissioner! These two are honored guests from afar. No need to give them the usual spiel. Hmm, come on in. Let's see what we can do for you. Huh! Did you get all that? Mister? M m my sincere apologies.
I am Hiragi Shinsuke, Kanjo Commissioner and Head of the Hiragi Clan. It's an honor to meet you both. Nice to meet you, sir. So, the reason we wanted to come and see you was because... All right, all right, all in good time. Two travelers renowned far and wide have shown up to see me, and I should very much like to make the... <laughs> Pretty famous, huh? Absolutely. Ha exactly! Pi and I hear you also foiled a fatu. Whoa! Hmm. Something wrong? <laughs> no, no, no. Rito is greatly honored to have you visit us. One other thing I heard about you is your great zip. Oh, sure! No problem! Whatever you need, right? Excellent. Well then. You must know the Qingxin, a flower grow- Yep, we've picked a few of those before. Yes, bring me 300 Qingxin, would you? Freshly picked, I mean. Uh, did Paimon hear that wrong? Hmm? Too much trouble is- Then how about this? We have a few items that need delivering. Or that sounds much more like it. 709 letters, to be precise. Terribly sorry. We're just a little short on people lately. What sort of an explanation is that? Traveler, what are we going to do? Should we really help this guy? That's the spirit. Don't keep me waiting too long now. <laughs> Taking this job? The terms are ridiculous! Halt, you two! Miss Hiragi has a letter for you. She insists that you read it immediately. A letter? Quick! Let Paimon see! So this means she wants you to secretly meet her at night? But you didn't seem surprised at all by this. What's going on?
I keep watch. You leave, you call me. Adventure time! Finally arrived. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hiragi Chisato. This is technically the second time we have met. It's a pleasure to see you again. Wow. She's the daughter of the Hiragi clan, all right. to be so formal. I've long marveled at your accomplishments, and at last we have the chance to meet. Is that Paimon, or does something seem a bit off here? The reason why I wanted to secretly meet you here is, well, I feared that I might never have another opportunity to discuss this with you. Discuss what? Ahem. I should like to ask for your help with delivering a letter. Like father, like daughter. Couldn't you be more original? No, you misunderstand me. Please, allow me to explain. I was hoping that you could deliver a letter to Narukami Island in my stead. It is to be given to Kujo Kamachi of the Tenryo Commission. My father has always forbidden me from communicating with him. He knows that there are prospects for my marriage that would better serve him politically. But my heart is with Kamaji. <sighs> there is no one who would dare defy my father's will on Rito, but you are outlanders. Outlanders seeking to get to Narukami Island. It would be regrettable to let such an opportunity pass. Oh, Paimon gets the whole picture now. Of course, in doing so, I will also do everything in my power to help you leave Rito. That is my promise. 
To be perfectly honest, as long as you remain in Inazuma, my father will have no intention of letting you leave Rito. Yeah, we figured as much. It was pretty obvious he was just trying to hold us up here. I secretly overheard a conversation between my father and a very arrogant-sounding woman just a few days ago. They seem to be discussing how to keep you here on Rito. In fact, it was the first time I had ever heard my father speak so respectfully to someone who wasn't the Shogun. We don't have much time. I'll tell you my plans to help you off the island. It just so happens that a shipment of goods is... Very well. I'll be waiting for you at the border. I'm counting on you to deliver my letter. Adventure time! Hold on, please. These goods are being sent to... Watatsumi Island? My lady, this is an unexpected honor. Uh, you are correct. These could Is there something wrong, Lady Hiragi? No, as you were. My lady, you aren't suggesting that you intend to escort this shipment personally. Please, do not cause us any further delay. If memory serves me right, my father has already asserted that this shipment must arrive on time. I'm certain punishment will be duly dispensed if- Yes, of course, my lady. It, it's just that, well, we don't know who this- Now, need I remind you of the penalty if anything were to happen to me en route? I'm sure you are all quite familiar with my father's temperament. Do you really presume that you can fully guarantee my safety on your own? Boy! Chisato can talk the talk! They don't stand a chance! Uh, uh, yes, my lady. Very well, then. It, it's an honor to have you accompanying us. Your safety is our highest priority. Shinojo, you can't really be agreeing to this. Well, the request is from Lady Hiragi herself. It is our duty to serve her in the utmost capacity. Yes, but that's not the problem here. Well, then, if we're through here, I suggest we set off at once. Dawdling will only allow potential thieves more- Yes, my lady. You heard her. There's no time to- My lady, please stay back. We'll handle it. Not as well as we'll handle it! Let's light it up! Freeze! Freeze. The wrong 
test subject. Monster sight! Prepare to counterattack! Protect Lady Hiraki at all costs! We'll take care of this! Stay with Chisato! The wrong test subject. Keep back! Watch out! More monsters inbound! Lady Hiraki, stay close! We can take refuge in the village up ahead. How are you faring, my lady? I'm perfectly all right. You may... In my letter, I've requested Kamaji to grant you a special travel permit from the Tenryo Commission. Consider it a token of my... My lady? Huh. So that's how it is. I, I had a feeling something was amiss, but Shinojo, you... No, lady... I'm not afraid to say that... The one you love? Shinojo, did you honestly think that... What? No, I, uh, <clears throat> I was just clarifying, that's all. I, I would never in my wildest dreams, uh... <clears throat> you two needn't worry, please. For yes, of course. As you wish, my lady. But what will happen if your actions here are discovered, Chisato? Don't fret. My father has always been one to spoil me. The worst he'd do is sentence me to half a day without food or something. Huh. I wish you a... Bye, Chisato! Come now. Quit your staring and let's get moving. We've got goods to shift. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Lightning Slash! Uh. 
terrible. Huh. Have a little taste. That Take it. Uh, picked the wrong test subject. I'll keep this close.
we go! I'll keep this close.
There's more! How's this? your time.
We go. Ow. Adventure time. Off we go. Adventure time!
lucky day! Good for storage. Yeah. <laughs> 
needs assistance. assistance. Treasure. Strange. Imagined. It's my lucky day. If 
adventure time! Off we go! Adventure time! Uh. Treasure. Strange. I keep watch. You leave, you call me. Avoid the trees. Follow me.
I taste blood. Adventure time! These things... useful?
we go. 